Three women shot, a young mother from the suburbs killed. The gun violence growing more out of control by the day. And tonight we're learning more about the young woman, the city's latest victim. I'm Jason Martinez. I'm Shana Humphreys. Let's get right outside to Chris O'Connell. Chris, what can you tell us about this tonight? Well, guys, she was a Delaware County mother of two gunned down early this morning in North Philadelphia. Tonight, police are still looking for her killers. They don't know why she was killed, but they do believe she was targeted. Philadelphia police identified 24-year-old Chandra Jones of Clifton Heights, a mother of two, seen here on her Instagram page as the city's latest homicide victim. Police say Jones was one of three women shot early this morning in Strawberry Mansion. Police say she and a friend just left a nightclub on West Sargent Street around 2.30. A few minutes later, they say a car pulled up next to hers on the corner of 33rd and Diamond and unleashed a hail of guns. Fire. So far, no motive, but police say they were targeted. A couple of shooters, based on the ballistic evidence, um, targeted the vehicle where the two women were shot and a second car where a third woman was shot. The murder happened on the same day officials held their bi weekly gun violence update. It takes a lot of life out of me and a lot of energy out of me. And I'm really sorry for what happened to that young lady and everyone else that's been killed. A lot of frivolous nonsense going on. A lot of people dying for no reason. It's it's crazy. She was she was a she was a good she was a good person. At one point, Jones worked as a youth care worker. Friends say she was trying to make something of her life and her two sons she clearly adored. She used to talk about her son all the time, how much she cared about him, how much she loved him. And uh, once again, Philadelphia police still looking for those gunmen. Homicide investigators are asking anyone with information or may have been at that nightclub early this morning to call Philadelphia police. Those two other women injured still remain hospitalized tonight. Shana. Just tragic. Chris O'Connell live at police headquarters. Thank you, Chris.